Hello Cardinals fan. Now I have sad news from our St. Louis Cardinals with upcoming rule changes. Stay until the end of the video and I'll tell you everything. All news from Cardinals breaking. While talk of upcoming rule changes, the pitch clock, bigger bases, and fewer pickoff pitches has prevailed this offseason, it's the schedule change that could have the biggest impact on a Cardinals team that has made few personnel additions. The club has won 93 games and a National League Central crown in 2022 mostly because of its 38-19 record against the Cubs, 74-88, Reds, 62-100, and Pirates, 62-100. The Cardinals won a pedestrian 10-9 against the Brewers and 34-38 against teams with a winning record. These shortcomings came to a head in the playoffs when they were eliminated in two games by the rookie Phillies. This is probably the toughest playoff series loss I've ever been through, admitted Cardinals star Nolan Arenado. Now, it's important to say goodbye and get that five-game series. I think we are capable of doing that. Under the new rules, the Cardinals will now play 52 games against their NL Central rivals down from 76. They will play six teams outside the NL Central six times and the other four seven times. The Mets and Dodgers are among the clubs that St. Louis will draw seven times. Already leave your like on this video because it is very important so you don't miss the latest news about the Cardinals, which we posted here. Thanks. Continuing. The biggest change for the Cardinals, of course, is that they will play 46 interleague games. The Cards and Royals will still play their I-70 rivalry four games, and the remaining games will be split into seven three-game home series against Blue Jays, Angels, Tigers, Astros, Yankees, Twins, and A's, and seven road series of three games against the Mariners, Red Sox, Guardians, Rangers, White Sox, Rays, and Orioles. This, of course, benefits fans who are eager to watch stars like Mike Trout, Shohei Otani, and Aaron Judge, who don't often come to town. According to Fangraphs, the Cards' chances of winning the NL Central dropped from 53.6% to 51.9% with the release of the most balanced schedule in MLB. Likewise, their chances of making the postseason dropped from 72.1% to 68.8%. Clearly, Things are going to get tougher for a team that will no longer be able to enter the postseason on the backs of their rebuilding NL Central brethren. This story is excerpted from John Denton's Cardinals Beat newsletter. To read the full newsletter, click here and subscribe to receive it regularly in your inbox. The impact Major League Baseball's balanced schedule could have on the Cardinals in 2023 could be evident as early as opening day. Last season, ST St. Louis was lucky to start with a three-game set at home against the Pirates, a team the Cards went 13-6 against while winning five of six series. This season, the Redbirds open at Bush Stadium against the Blue Jays, the team that added Dalton Varsho, Chris Bassett, and Kevin Kiermaier to an already loaded roster that won 92 games and made the playoffs last season. Hey Cardinals fan! Put your opinion in the comments. It's very important to update you at any moment with the latest Cardinals news. Until the next video.